Hey guys, I'm Whistler, this is a more replay, Vagrant Story, and let's go. Last time we went through the very long intro, and we found about about the VKP, which is us, the Crimson Blades, who seem to be led by the Cardinal, and the cultist group Millicamp, who we need to now track down their leader in the city of Limond. And so we've now entered the wine cellar, which is the only way into Limond. Yep. Yeah. Up here. I was always really impressed when you, uh, like, I thought about it and realised how quite impressive these graphics were. Considering the date, like, you know, that's a PlayStation era. And I think not even the best looking Final Fantasy games looked this good. Well, got her open. It's no good. Not even a budge. What's this? It weren't locked a moment ago, eh? No keys hold this door. It'd be a grimoire that's doing this. Well, who locked it in then? Someone inside? Bugger if I know. Look. We'll be cut off from the others. And where are those goats, man? They have not returned. This be no time for loafing around. Keep your cap on, brother. Now come up here and take a look at this. What's that? Grimoire. And so if we look at the door, this door is locked with a camel sigil, sigil, which is essentially a grimoire that's keeping the door locked. And if I remember really, yep, heal panel right there. Always remember that's there. It's so bloody useful. It's not funny. This too be a grimoire doing by the gods. I'd oft heard of it, but this and a worm, a dragon was sighted at the Duke's manor. Well, if there's magic about, dragons won't be far behind. I worry about Gordenstern and others. Ack, they'll be fine. Think of it. If we've witnessed miracles such as these on Limon's doorstep. What li then lies within? He were native, like a crest, brother. Surely the masters know of this grimoire. Mayhaps we've just been in the dark, eh? Yet our charge is to drop those Miller Camp scoundrels in. And procure the miracles of Limond. Tis just a rumor, but I have heard that Guildenstern lots works them magics as well. Rubbish. We're the servants of the Lord. No true knight of the cross would dabble in the black arts. It's only a rumor, brother. But if sin is truly the worker of Diablo. What is that? Diablory? They claim he is. I can say, fight fire with fire. I say, let the Lord be our shield. Ever the choir boy. Ha, <laughs> lame. The only shield I see is the one covering your eyes. Heretic or no, I believe what I see even right now, I see sorcery. Swine will take wing for the likes of the use of magic, my friend. Aye, but with a grimoire, your fattest sow could qualify. My swiftest falcon, if you believe the chronicles. With a grimoire, you say? Ye could even make cobblestones float like clouds. The fuck? Uh, bugger. And so we now need to fight these guys off. If I remember rightly, the weakest point, even though it says the arms, it's best to go straight for the head. Oh! Shut up. Shut up. Don't say a word. What? Tis magic this is. Okay, I'm going for your legs. Ah, keep hitting the environment, that's what it is. Ha! Your head be mine. Go on, go on. Ah, I wasn't ready. Ow! And it's always best to go for the same guy until he dies, because trying to fight both of them at the same time, you'll leave. Well, you'll most likely just lead yourself into headaches. 
This man goes for a lot of in this game. Come at me, bro. Ha! He came at me. Come on, you took that many hits. Just come on. Good boy. Yeah, that was a pain in the ass. Okay, and there's a save point here. But we won't bother. And there's a storage chest here. And the idea is that's just for storing items because you'll eventually be a bit full of inventory and it's best not to just drop everything. Ah, uh, floating pedestals. You're the bane of my existence in this game. Now, if I remember lately, there's a trap panel right there. Oh. Different room. Ow! Do you mind? I've been philosophical. I know what the word. And luckily, wolves are fairly easy to manage to get around. And why am I doing this? I don't need to do it right now. Oh yeah. Um, in the middle, of this top bit here. Um, is a trap panel right where I'm facing, and it would do like 60 damage, which is not a good thing, so we'll avoid that. Here comes one of the Parliament's watchdogs. You go back and silence the y his yapping. Parliament's watchdogs? An agent of the VKP. You can follow orders, can you not? The VKP is your enemy. Now go! Sir! Ah! I wasn't ready yet. Meh. Ha! Your right arm is mine. Ow! These fights get a lot more interesting when you start learning the uh, breaker abilities. For the time being, they're not that interesting. Uh, he's going to shoot me the second I land. It looks pretty swift. Ha! Yum yum. That's again. This is a big one. I'm welcome here. Wonder what gave you that clue. Yeah. Don't like bats. And now that we're to deal with bats, I actually didn't realise that like way back when I played this game when I was younger, I n always missed this place for some reason. It's also a good idea to go here because you actually get a nice bit of um, experience as well. door has been locked. Oh bugger. I was trying to be all awesome and dodge the attacks. And jump 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 Damn Because idea is if you jump down in the background in the ground then he wouldn't be able to hit me until he landed on the ground. The door has been unlocked and so that way I'd be able to do two hits in ten when he would only get one. We'll open the chest here, which we get the seventh heaven, which I do believe is a reference to Final Fantasy Seven. I think. Like okay, I've not not seen it anywhere, but I think it is. We get a reinforced glove, vera root, and a cure root. The vera roots are essentially you use that to recover risk, which I'll get into later when I actually start using a lot more uh, risk um, abilities. Yeah, I thought there was more in this room. Go back for here. Ha! 
No. Bad wolf. I know. <laughs> Ooh, we did drop a better route. And you're not going to hit me. Okay, ah, and our first puzzle of the game. Do to do, which we need to do this. I'm pretty sure the way this works is pretty much we just need to put one box down. Yep, that's enough. These puzzles get a lot more harder eventually. Okay, but. He's dead. And jump. And you're not getting to hurt me. Yeah. Okay, and oh, this one. Goody gum drops. Oh, yeah, this is actually. I don't know why they put this. It's like a puzzle, but it's like the most easiest puzzle to manage. Ashley stands in front of a lever. Pull the lever, of course. What good is the lever if you do not pull it? The door's closing. Yeah, neither of you have like two seconds to get through. I actually made it through. Yay! What the hell was that all about? Which, I know you all be asking, but I know what it is, and I need something to shut up. It, it feels weird playing a game I've played so frequently in the past, because it's just all these little bits, and I'd, be like, I, you know, I'd usually be like, oh my god, yeah, I remember this bit, and I'd start blabbering on about the extreme plot lines, and I would pretty much ruin the entire point of this let's play. Easy puzzles. And there's a save point there, but I won't bother. And in the chest we get a cure potion and a cure bulb. Yay! Just to ensure I've got enough health. And uh, it is 750. Let's go. Here we have Manator, the first boss of the game. And so he's essentially a physical he's weak to piercing, physical, and he's a beast mon a beast creature, if you can tell. So we'll just quickly give him a few shots in the head. I don't think he likes the shots in the head. Fuck. Ow! Pretty sure that would do more than that amount of damage. But it should have a bit more. It'd be really awkward if I died on the first boss. Especially if I have the saving. And good. Oh bugger. Ow! And let's see. We can do the most damage to his head. Of course. And then skis. We beat the boss. We are awesome. Uh, and here we go. This is the most, like, the most annoying bonus thing ever. Like this thing can go either way for me. I'm going to get something horrible. I know what. Oh, okay. No, I'm going to shut up. Whistler, shut up. Got strength too. Really nice. 
We also get the Camo Sigil, which we need for the door. We got the gr Grimoire Grella, Grella blah, 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 which is the healing spell, and Grimoire Debile, which does gen degenerate on monsters, which makes them their, which makes their strength weaker. Pelter Shield, Verabulb, and Judicial's Tear. Also, I need to, I probably just point out now um, how you noticed I had map complete 3%. We are not going to get 100% in this game unless I've done a second playthrough, which I'm probably never ever going to do, because bugger that. <laughs> okay, so now let's head back and. Oh, but wait. Sydney. So, this is a risk breaker. Most men complacently accept knowledge as truth. They are sheep, ruled by fear. But you are different. Always calm, detached. A smooth flow of thought into action, unlike that sentence. Indeed, it is almost as if... As if you had no soul. Oh! Oh! Snap! How do you do it? body and soul are one, yet yours are separate, like a child from his night in his storybook. Where is your soul, Restbreaker? Is this VKP training? Or did you see something that made you shut your soul away? Show me your soul. your beloved wife and child. They were slain by the fallen knights. Jackal. Wrong. You failed to protect your wife and your child. You failed in your duties as a knight, as a husband, as a father. You killed them. Say nay. Try to catch me, Ashley Wyatt. Look outside yourself to find the truth. What's your game? Harden! Ashley! Merlos! Jim! Bob! Pay no heed to me. Bleah. Pay no heed to me. Take them right. The city of shit will forgive your sins, my son. And call forth a power that, power that lies within you even now. This is my game. I run, you give chase. I am the heart and you are the hunter. But this heart has laid a few snares of his own. I am waiting for you, Westbreaker. Behold, Sydney! Damn. Why can't I look at it like that? Ashley has recovered the battle abilities from his suppressed memory. What is happening? I am waiting for you, Ashley Wyatt. And so... Oh. And this is our first dummy as well. 
but anyway, this is probably going to be the end of the episode. So I am Whistler, this is Morbid Play, and this is Vagrant Story, and I hope to see you guys next time. Later.